Did you know that the moon keeps moving further and further away from the Earth? The moon moves away from the Earth 3.8 centimeters each year. We know this because on one of our journeys to space, astronauts left on the surface of the moon some reflectors. From the Earth, scientists beamed some lasers into space that bounced off the reflectors and returned back to our planet. Thanks to the journey of the lasers, scientists could measure the exact distance between the Moon and the Earth. The moving away of the Moon makes each day longer. A long, long time ago, when the Moon was a lot closer to the Earth, Days lasted about five hours, but as our satellite moved further away, each day got longer, until reaching 24 hours. Did you know that if we were on the moon, we would weigh six times less? In fact, if a person weighed 60 kilos on the Earth, on the moon, they would only weigh 10 kilos. This is due to gravity. Gravity is a force which attracts other objects, either on the moon or on the earth. This attraction depends on mass. As the earth is six times bigger than the moon, it is to say it has six times more mass, it attracts other objects with six times more strength. It is clear that on the Moon, we would all feel lighter. Did you know that if you drop a hammer and a feather on the Moon from the same height, they will both land at the same time? As Galileo predicted, more than four centuries ago, in an environment without air, like on the Moon, there is no resistance on objects, so they will land at the same time, even if their weight and masses are different. During the Apollo 15 mission, the astronaut David Scott dropped from the same height a hammer and a hawk's feather. As there is no resistance, because there is no air on the moon, both objects landed on the ground practically at the same time showing that the predictions Galileo had in the 16th century were correct.